All right, so to solve this by completing the square, we need the left-hand side to be a perfect square. So the first thing that I usually do is I just kick this, whatever number is over here, the C, I guess it would be, just kick it over yeah. to the right-hand side, okay? So, because all I'm really worried about is analyzing B to figure out how to make the right, or sorry, the left, a perfect square. So I kick that over to the right. And then there's two ways that you can approach this. One way is just to kind of intuit what it must be so like you look at six and you know that it's got to be two times whatever is squared over here so you might be like oh well that would be three so this has got to be three squared so it must be nine the way that's more systematic and probably easier for our students to remember is just to remember that this number over here has to be b over two squared okay so what is b well b is six all right so that's six over two squared so that would be three squared which would be nine Okay, so that tells you the number that you're going to add to make this a perfect square. Okay, okay that's that's what I did. Okay, I good. don't know if I did it for all of them, but that's what I did. Okay, good. So, um, so let's clean this up a little bit. So if I do that, then this is a perfect square, and it's going to be x plus 3 squared. On the right, I'm going to have 1. Okay. So then... What's nice about this is now I can use the square root property. So I can just go square root of the left, square root of the right, plus or minus, because it's a variable. And then I'm gonna get x plus three on the left-hand side. And on the right, I'll get plus or minus the square root of one. Well, that's just plus or minus one. Then I'm gonna minus three to both sides. And I get x equals negative three plus or minus one. Okay, so that's two solutions. And the two solutions are either x equals negative three plus one, be x equals negative 2 or x equals negative 3 minus 1 should be x equals negative 4. Okay. So that's your two answers.